Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're just stumbling upon this video. My name is Madeline and I post new videos every Sunday. So in this video, I'm gonna be doing my Amazon favorites part two. I will link part one below, but it did this video did super well and you guys seemed to really, really like it. So I thought I'd do another one because I went and looked at my purchase history and was like, oh my gosh, I have enough stuff that I could do a whole new video for. So I think you guys will really enjoy this. Um, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe. New videos every Sunday, all things lifestyle, vlogs, fashion hauls, all that fun stuff. Um, and then make sure to follow me on Instagram at Madeline A. Woods. And let's just go ahead and jump into it. The first thing I'm going to be talking about is this mirror. So you might have been seen, I don't know, sorry if that's annoying. Um, so you might have seen this mirror all over Instagram or similar mirrors to this, but there has just been a huge trend when it comes to taking mirror pictures, but in really cool antique looking mirrors like this. And I have followed someone, I can't remember who it was, but she posted an affiliate link to this um, saying it was great for taking pictures. And also I just really like it. I prop it up by my nightstand and just gives a really cool touch. I think I could even lay it down flat like this and use it as a tray and put like perfumes on it. So that'll be a really cool thing to do. I like kind of making my bathroom have those kind of vibes. Um, but yeah, it was super, it's really light um, and it was pretty cheap. I think it was around $20. So yeah, I will have all of this stuff linked down below also. Next, we have this amazing throw. So I'll insert a picture right here of how it looks on our bed, but it is just very thick, feels great. Feels like it's really just nice quality. Um, and it has kind of that Aztec vibe that I really, it's super my style. I really like to mix like those kind of neutrals and those different textures with also a flare like that mirror I showed you guys. So that was cool. Um, and this one, I know they had different patterns as well. And I think you guys will really enjoy this blanket. It's great as a throw, you can put it on your couch. You can actually just use it as a blanket if you wanted to. Um, and it's really in style right now, so. Next we have these earrings I'm wearing right here with butterflies on. I'll zoom in if I can, and then I'll also insert a picture so it's clearer. But I've just been seeing butterfly earrings everywhere a lot lately and the websites they were on, I don't know, I just feel like the things that I like come and go pretty quickly and so I didn't want to spend like 70 or 80 dollars on a pair of earrings and so I just decided to look it up on Amazon and sure enough, I found these that look super similar to like Love AJ, Adina's Jewels and they're awesome. They're super light, they clasp really nicely in the back and I just love them. I've always loved butterflies so. Next we have Amazon swimsuits. So you kind of have to dig a little bit and even if you see a swimsuit that you like the look of it but you don't necessarily like the pattern, just click on it and most of the time they'll have different patterns or just different suit options from the same company because this one wasn't as obvious when I found it but it was one of those different options. So it's like a high-waisted bottom. It looks cheekier than it is. It's actually not that crazy when you put it on. And then the top is really cute. Um, come on, man and it's just a little top and it has a little cutout right here and then i also got another one with polka dots i'll insert pictures as well so you guys can see a little bit better but they're really nice quality this one is it's you know sometimes when um high waisted bathing suits you can put them on and you feel just kind of like a busted can of biscuits because it's squeezing you in so hard right here this one is super flattering um it doesn't grip you too hard it makes it really flattering um from you know right here and then all the way down and kind of elongates the legs so this one was probably my favorite that i got and then the polka dot one too was awesome that one's just my favorite so next we have a pair of sunglasses so if you guys watched my latest um summer trend video i posted i will link that below too i, I talked about these and how the rectangle and like elongated sunglass look I've been seeing a lot is really in style. And kind of the same thing with the butterfly earrings. I really like it, but I don't know how long I'm gonna like it. So I didn't wanna spend, you know, I've seen sunglasses almost identical to this for $200. I just really didn't wanna do that. So I did a little digging on Amazon and found these guys and I love them. I think they also had one that was, these are like kind of blue tinted on the lenses and they had ones that were more brown tinted. So. Hopefully those are still available too, but these are great. They, I have, I think if you were, if I was to pick my face shape, it'd be round. And sometimes with these in ordering online, you just never know how short it's gonna be on your face because that's just not very flattering, but these go out perfectly and are very flattering on the face. So if you're worried about that, have no worries because they look 
super cute. So this is probably the least exciting thing to talk about, but it's my most used by far. It is these silicone straws, and I like how they're a little bit fatter. Um, I love drinking my water out of these. I've always been a straw chewer, so I've always liked to chew on a straw. Um, and these are really nice though, because obviously with the metal ones, you can't really chew on it or that would hurt. Um, but, and then also it's just great, you know, to use these instead of plastic to help the environment. So these are really, really great. And I like all the fun colors and it also comes with one of those pipe cleaners. So you don't have to worry about them getting super dirty and icky, but I really, really like these. And I think they had other colors as well. So this handy little guy is my Bluetooth shower speaker. This was another one of those things during quarantine where I just thought that'd be really nice to be able to listen to music while in the shower and not have it outside of the shower and where I can't really hear it that well. So I got this guy, it's awesome. One thing I also noticed was my sister was calling me when I was in the shower one time and there's a little phone button right here and it was ringing and I just, I was in the shower and I thought maybe I'll, I'll press it. And I pressed it and I go, hello? And my sister was like, hey. It was the craziest thing. You could talk on the phone in the shower, which was really nice. Um, music is really nice to listen to, but just to be super like honest with you guys, when I listen to podcasts with this, it sounded a little muffled. Like I listen to the morning toast a lot and they talk so fast that it was kind of hard to keep up with, especially when I'm like washing my hair. So. I definitely recommend music and if you're expecting a casual phone call that's great too and i think this was only like 15 dollars so if you need anything from this haul you should definitely get this because it makes those long showers just go by so much faster i have a few organization items i didn't bring in here but i'll insert pictures just because they're already all organized in my kitchen cabinets but the first one is this um pan organization rack y'all this is such a game changer but you know how you just have all your pans stacked up and then if you need one from the bottom you have to kind of like lift up all the other ones and pull it out well this makes it kind of like a bookshelf where you can like lay them up and then pull them out and it is just the best thing that ever happened to me i swear it makes my cooking experience so much better um then also i have these food storage containers that i got it was just one of those quarantine activities that gave me something to do one day and i also have a label maker because i have one from work and i put like all the labels on them it was just the most satisfying thing like just pouring the rice into the jar it was awesome um and also when it comes to if you need to scoop out a cup of sugar rather than having to open up the paper bag you can just open up this really aesthetically pleasing plastic container scoop it in like it's just so much easier and then it just also just looks really cute um and then the last thing i had three of them were these bins so you can i think the way they were originally used or like showed um shown on amazon is you put them in the fridge as like fridge organize organizers which is great so you can put you know your fruits in there and stuff well i use but I didn't really need that, so I put it in my pantry and made a little section for baking stuff, um, one for snacks, breads that they could fit, and it just made it a lot easier because we don't, we kind of have limited storage here just with our apartment. Um, but I know I'll find a way to use them when we have a house soon, so yeah. So this is my three rod curler. It's a hair waver, so you put your hair in it. I'm sure you guys have seen this, but you put your hair in it like that and then you just keep inching it down and it waves your hair it very similar look to when you sleep in braids but it just looks a little more sleek i haven't played around with this a lot i've done it once um but i've just been seeing it all over tiktok and stuff and this one was really reasonably priced so i decided to get it off amazon um but you can also get it at ulta and stuff like that but this one was just cute and pink and pretty reasonably priced and it heats up really nicely and it works really good okay you guys that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it happy shopping if you haven't already make sure to subscribe new videos every sunday and i love you guys so much and i will see you in my next one bye